To the stage is where we follow Pacific Island artists as they build up to the big performance. Like on stage, TV, film, sports field, me umanga. That's how we roll, everywhere with rolls. And this week we follow one of the talented actors from the island cast, Matsuriki. It's a local film that hit the big screen last year. So what's with the hats? It's to show that I'm from Western Samoa. Oh, eh? heaps of cowboys in Samoa, eh? A couple of donkeys, eh? <laughs> <laughs> When I first came to New Zealand, I, I wanted to become a rugby player. You know, like all the other Samoan kids, I wanted to be all black or pay for the money Samoan team. But um, as I got older, things started to change for me and I fell into acting. To be or not to be. You're making this. Oh, take me for a ride. Aliki is like the daredevil and I think I'm more like the policeman on the side. He is very courageous in the things he does, but for me, I like to think that I have a little bit of sense of justice. You know, everyone has a little fancy about being, you know, naughty and doing all these bad things. So I think I just kind of dove into my dark side, like my Batman. But the whole day, I just been thinking about this premiere I'm having today. And I've got to make it all the way back out south. You know, I've got to actually spruce myself up a bit more and um, you know, make sure I look good in front of the, all the cameras, photographers, people are going to be there. Oh, well, I've arrived with my family at the premiere and the only thing going through my head right now is um, do I look good? Is my hair on the right side? How do my shoes look? Make sure not to slip up, not to do anything stupid. Uh, so I'm pretty nervous right now. Yes, yeah, so the sun's going to the theatre, but my parents are missing. Mm. <laughs> the sun's filming is lost. Trust didn't disappear at a time like this. That was really strange. It just kind of disappeared at a crucial moment. <laughs> Island time, eh? But it was okay, we got in there, we got in there. Gosh. You're old enough to go to prison, just like your brother. See? My turn. I'm driving this time, okay? You know how? I've watched my dad. He's Asian, right? <laughs> what I'll be most nervous about is how the audience is gonna respond to the movie, and especially my performance, because I'm lined up against guys like Sarah Wiseman, Hitsua He, Jared Rowdy, Alex, you know? Um, these guys are just big names in the industry, and they've been there for a long time, and Coming in for the first time, um, an amateur like me being in a film with them, um, I'm, I'm hoping that I held my own for them to see what I've been working towards and what I love. It just lifted a really heavy burden for me. I'm so happy and thankful for my son um, doing um, um, like his job like an actor. I'm so happy and proud of him. Jason has a quality about him in the movie that is, it was really freaky to see when they were shooting. It was like, whoa, what the? He was really fresh, he was in every moment, every scene that I did with him and um, I'm really happy and privileged and, and uh, very respectful of Michael and what he's done with the film and with Jason and what he did with the scripts. It's a real true performance of someone being someone who they really are not but really getting under the skin of the character and completely committing and it's a beautiful, beautiful performance and um, he's a guy with a big future ahead of him. I was lucky enough to land this role and I'm just an ordinary South Auckland guy like all of you guys. You know, if I'm lucky enough to get it, maybe one day you guys will be as well if you really love it. So just reach for the stars and, you know, you might grab one of them. <laughs>